What is up, YouTube? This is your boy, Mr. Benjamin, a.k.a. Till Car Collector. Today is Sunday, April 2nd, 2017. I'm glad y'all had a chance to look at this video, because to be perfectly honest, I think this video is going to be taken down by the FCC. And the reason why and this video is just so obscene, so much card porn on here, autograph porn, no homo intended, but it's just, it's too much. It's, it's too obscene. The FCC is going to take this video down, because it's just, wow, that's all I can say. First, let me start with um. Let's start here. Yeah, I'll start with um certified autographs. I was feeling kind of lucky, and I thought I was feeling kind of lucky because I got some of this um sage hit draft fo um football. Didn't really get anything really too good, but you never know. These guys haven't been drafted yesterday; so might turn out to be worth something. And to get my leaf fix of leaf prospect autographs, I got some of these certified. So, like I said, these are like kids in high school and college, so they haven't really. Did anything in pros yet? Because they're still in school. Or well, some of them might have went to the minors, but like I said, I, I just buy these on the whim. I really don't know too much about this. This is my, my, actually my first one on one. This is a one on one of who's this guy here? Um, Sam Lanier. One on one. Where does it say one on one? It is one on one. I thought it was one on one. Yeah, right here. Printing plate one on one. There you go. So I'm happy about that. And I paid like, I think $5 for this, and the other one's like $2 a piece. So you can't beat that. I got some Hall of Fame autographs. I got Elvin Hayes certified autograph. This girl should make it all the fame. Well, she's not eligible yet, but I think she will eventually um, swing cash. Because if you look on her college and WNBA resume, I mean, she didn't put up gaudy individual numbers, but she won championships, so that's what it's all about. I also have a Gail Goodridge certified autograph, so excited about that. And as far as my cards, TTM, Mark Brunel, I paid him like a $5 donation, so he signed for a card, so... I'm cool with it. I actually like Brunel. He was one of my favorite quarterbacks from back in the day. Next one I got is a funny story. I got this guy, John Pulaski. Um, I was looking on the schedule. He was a manager, I think, of Western Kentucky, I think. But um, I saw George say he was playing Northern Kentucky, so I got too confused. So I went and ordered the cards thinking I'd get him signed in person, but it's the wrong team. So I was like, what the hell? I'll just send some of these TTM. So I sent him TTM. So just Google or YouTube this guy. Not YouTube. Um. Look at look him up, find out which team he manages, and send to us the team he manages in college, you know, sign. But the college season's winding down, so you want to hurry up and hit him up if you're trying to do that. Next one I'm excited about, this is College Football Hall of Famer, Tommy T. Casanova. I asked him to write College Football Hall of Fame, he didn't, but it's still all good. So he hooked all these up for me. He's a doctor now, so it's Dr. Casanova, so when you write, make sure you refer to him as doctor. And this is a kind of funny one. I got Eddie White. He signed one, two. He signed three D. Wrote his little note, clown in my handwriting. He said, "Would you like to sign? Would you like me to sign with this kind of autograph?" <laughs> he clowned my poor handwriting. So, yeah, I do appreciate him signing. I got some more Hall of Fame love. Bobby, oh not Bobby Knight, on um, Bob Hurley Senior. He signed two. And then, what do you know, I found another card. I might end up getting another card with some cards that I bought, but I might send that to him later on. I might just do something with it, so I don't know. But, um, like, this is on Alan Jenner, so, Michael, you'll love this if you don't already have this. Yeah, check it out. And I got Jerry Sloan. I actually got three of these. One of these going to PSA. And this one, I love these old-school vintage basketball cards. I used to have a bunch of these when I was a kid, but don't anymore, so I'm trying to build my bench game back up and this one looks kind of sweet too so check that out now that, that was obscene just the way it is right there i mean i'm not even gonna get into the next part the next part will just it'll blow your mind all right where do i start i went to see some college baseball at georgia tech hence the little game program i got joey bart he signed this the game program he doesn't have any baseball cards as far as I know. If he does, I don't have any. Let me ooh, I don't show the wrong thing on here. I don't want to show that yet. And he signed this um, card right here. This autograph card. I'll put this away here because I definitely don't want to show this now. And then I got Micah Carpenter from Georgia Tech. He finally knocked the rest of these out. So I don't want to buy them no more this year. And Georgia Tech was playing Clemson. So I'll show some of the Clemson players. And this Mitchell Miller, he knocked all these out for me. And this, I didn't know, this is actually Paul Bird's son. Paul Bird used to play for the Braves. He's an announcer. He signed eight. One of the cards slipped out, but these are 
all the next sign here. I'm gonna actually pull all these off and just put them in my box here. I got KJ Bryant again signed A, but one of these slipped off, so I'm gonna pull these out and put them in the box here. I got Drew Warden after the game. He signed all eight. What else we got here? And I got this is Georgia Tech again. This is um what's this guy named? Um, I'm drawing a blank. I I got this guy so many times. Number six, the outfielder Ryan. Um, I forgot his last name, but he's an outfielder for the Braves. Um, Resher Senior. Yeah, not Braves. I said Braves. I'm Georgia Tech. Then I got Kel Johnson. Braves season about to start in a couple of days, but you know these are my Braves here. You know what I'm saying? Because this is much better and easier than going to Cobb County. Oh, I gotta hurry up the video because time's running low on my phone. And here's the extra on KJ. And next to the bird right here. Now, there was a failure. Unfortunately, I didn't get these cards signed from Seth Beer, so that was a failure. But I got these signed from Seth Beer. Ah, Able Fools. Look at that. So he signed that. And he signed all this. So Seth Beer is, in my opinion, next Chris Bryant. Get him while he's in college because, you know, when they go pro. I mean, he was real nice about it. He was like, yeah, you were polite. I'll sign for you, but get him now. That's all I got to say. Here's one more Seth Beers. And for the most I've seen part, you know, this is not suitable for work. Hide, you know, hide your kids. Cover their eyes up. Boom. I got Chipper Jones. He was at the game. I didn't know he was going to be up there. So he signed this. And he signed the ball for me. Boo, yeah. Like I said, it was just two I've seen. This, I was talking about how good North Carolina was the other day. This might actually beat North Carolina between the quality and, the, and quantity of the graphs I got. So let me know. Was I do better in North Carolina, do better in Clemson. I got Louisville coming up, so I need to go ahead and talk to my peoples, get some more cards for them. Um, well, this video is about to run out real soon. 